what I'm going to do is I'm going to send you over this link in the chat and just go ahead and click on that link. You should see it in the, in the Zoom uh, chat. So if you come back to the, I think if you click on the Zoom icon at the bottom. Zoom icon at the bottom. You're talking about this guy here? Yeah. So if you click on that, see if, um, or unless you can see the, the, the control panel, like I see the Zoom control panel. Do you not see this right here? I see or your Facebook ads. No, it says profitwithcarta.online. Is that yeah, what I Click on that. Yeah, click on that. I, but I don't see that. Yeah, I don't. There we go. Okay. Now, now it's opening up. Perfect. Now I see it. Okay, cool. So all you're going to do is just go to the, scroll to the bottom and then you'll just, I think it says start demo or something like that. Yeah, start your trial. Perfect. And all you do is a starter one. Don't, you don't need that one right now. Just do the, the starter one. This guy. Yeah, perfect. Okay, cool. And then let me go ahead and. Okay, perfect. So this is, this is the full blown setup. Okay, cool. So we're good. So right here, that name, put your business name or put, you can put your name or you can put your business name, but that name you, you won't be able to change in the future. Um, that one, that one name, this will be the link that's tied to every page until we add our own custom domain. Okay. So right now you can just, yeah, you could just go with that one. It might be too long actually. Um, okay. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Would that fit? Yeah. Okay, cool. So go in and put in a password I hate this I mean Okay cool so Welcome. Yay. We're good. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take you through a full like a full blown setup so we make sure that we got all this stuff right. So scroll down and then um, see if you got an email. Make sure you got, you got those emails. Sometimes they'll land in spam, but okay, perfect. So you're good. Okay, so here's what we'll, we'll, we'll want to do first. Click on, um, yeah, click on the emails real quick. Let's just go through them real quick. Welcome to Kartra. Because there, there's, I don't know if it's the first one or the second one that I Can want I you to. Them? Okay, so scroll through this. So this is the Kartraverse, which we'll, we'll bookmark. Actually, we haven't figured out how to bookmark yet. Damn, that's another thing on my to-do to -do list. Well, we could do this, didn't we? But bookmark. yeah, you can hit it. Well, actually, it's not this. You're not bookmarking your email, but you'll bookmark that link right there. So the Kartra, that Kartra, not, that's just for like extra training videos. Like I'm going to help you with all this shit, but okay. if you ever like need extra type of training videos, that's that link right there. Okay. So click on the top one. Welcome to Kartra. Okay, so there's your login. Okay, perfect. So click on that login page link. That's your login. So definitely bookmark this page. So bookmark this, just name it Kartra. There you go, perfect. And then hit done. So this is your actual login. Perfect. Okay, cool. So leave that open. Let's let's um let's actually go back to the cart to the second tab, that middle tab, Kartra Welcome. Yeah, click on that tab right there. Yeah, up, right. Yeah. So let's scroll through this real quick. So go down. So we got the emails. We're good with there. We're good with that. So now scroll down, access to your Kartra account. We got that. We book, bookmarked that. And then, and then the Kartra not training. We got that email about that. Mm -hmm. And then register for the weekly Q&A. This right here is, is what I want you to, to register for. Even if you can't make it live, they'll email you the record, the, the, they'll email you the recording. Yeah. So if you can't make it live, you'll get the recording. Just register for this. But this right here, I'm telling you, D, like I cannot stress it enough, man. And it's going to sound super biased, but it is, it is what it is. Like I'm trying to tell you right now, I'm, I can't stress it enough. The two most important things that any small business owner needs in 2021 and beyond when it comes to marketing, 
their business on social media. I'm going to make this very, very clear. The only two mm -hmm. things you need are Facebook ads and Kartra. That's it. That's it. That's it. So right here, we're taking the time. We're investing the time. We're investing our resources to learn Facebook ads. That's on one side. And then also I'm going to teach you and train you in all this shit about Kartra. That's the other side. These two things right here, man, you can blow up any business, any business. Okay. And, 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 and so I can't stress it enough. So in this case, the reason why I'm bringing that up is because there's training. So if we, if, if we can make these training calls, you want to learn this system. You want to learn the Kartra system. You're going to have me. So we can always jump on calls. I'm going to be here no matter what. I can help you with all that shit. Setting up pages, setting up the email. We're going to do all that. But sometimes if you're just on a day where we can't connect, then these Kartra calls are so important. Every Tuesday and Thursday, they go live at 1 p.m. where it's just a Q&A. So the, 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 um, the Kartra support team, they just do a Q&A. So anybody can come on, ask a question, and they'll answer it in real time. They'll screen share. They'll walk you through it. Like it's very detailed. And they do it for an hour every Tuesday and Thursday. But if you can't make it live, again, what they do is they, they'll send you the recording. Okay. okay. So let's send you the recording. So you have that amazing call, those two amazing calls every week. And then you have me to help you with this entire landing page software. Amazing. Okay. So, so now that we're registered, we're good. So go back to the other tab, the Kartra one, see if there's anything else there that we need to know about. Um, scroll down, scroll down. So word class support. Okay. So, and then join the Facebook group. So click on that and let's, let's join the Facebook group real quick. So another, another support you know feature is this Kartra group so if you freaking have anything so are you using are you so go ahead and click yes and then just um it may ask you for the email scroll down is there anything else below yeah i agree Interested? i agree yeah okay perfect so click submit okay cool so you'll have me you'll have those two live weekly training calls and then you have this facebook group with twenty one thousand people so if you're stuck on anything ask a question and freaking you'll have a ton of people reply. This group is also good to find people that are in your niche. Oh, nice. So, so you can freaking put a comment. Hey, is anybody, is that, does anybody run a massage place and are using Kartra? I'd love to chat with you and see how we can maybe, you know, you know, shit like that. Like you can find, right. there's a, there's probably a quite a few different people that are running a spa, a freaking some type of massage place, like for sure, for sure. Like okay. you can collaborate and, 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 see what the hell they're doing nice so everyone yeah. in here is really really cool so go back to the Kartra tab real quick the other Kartra tab and let's see what else is in there I think that might be it so it gets yeah so you don't need this part hire an expert you don't need that download download the eight steps to your first sell checklist um, you can you can download that but I'm gonna walk you through a lot of that shit but if it's a PDF just you might as well just download it just to have yeah, it, this, 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 this can't hurt at all. To read through that later on, like, cannot hurt. So again, D, as much as this shit may sound like a foreign language, you'll learn it quick, like you will, but you have to, you have to be willing to learn it. And that's why I'm trying to break it down how simple this can really be. Facebook ads, Kartra, that's it. That's okay. it. Like, that's, there's nothing else to know about freaking building a business online. It's those two, those two platforms. That's all okay. we need. So the more you can invest in learning this type of shit and reading the different shit, like, it, it can only help. It can only help. Okay. Okay. So, and I trust you, by the way. Thank uh, you. God bless you for sure. For sure. For sure. So let's go back to, um, let's go back to Kartra real quick. Let's, um, let's log in a Kartra real quick. So go to click on, yeah, you can go. Yeah. Perfect. And then just hit login. So what I'll do real quick, let's just do a quick update on this. So hit a, I agree. And let's just, um, welcome your brand new oh. car. Sorry. You could just you could just put okay. I watched it because I'm gonna just give you a crash course real quick. Okay, oh. so let the Kartra experience begin. Hit that green one. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do real quick. Let's um. Do you use do you actually we won't do that part yet. Just click on click on the the top right in the top right hand corner, that uh, profile picture. Yeah, click on that and then let's go to go to profile. And then add a picture there. Do you have any picture or any random picture? Yeah. Yeah, let's just clean up this shit real quick. Okay. 
So change that to your time zone. Yeah, it should definitely in oh, Arizona. Okay. Arizona, perfect. And then just hit save. Okay, cool. So so that just having that basic info in there is, is super important because that image, and you can change that image later, like, cause you want it to be, I don't know why it ended up that way, but, and every time you save anything, when you're in this profile, it'll ask you for that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay, cool. So, and then scroll down to the bottom, contact details. You got everything. Everything's fine. Okay, perfect. Okay, cool. To, before we get back to the ads manager because we have to set up a few pages in order to even connect to the ads manager. So in here, what we'll just do for now is we'll just set up a couple pages just to have as, as, as just templates, but we'll be able to use them for sure. But we, we don't have to worry about fully editing them right now. Let's just get them up. So click on pages to the left, my pages. And let me just kind of give you a walkthrough of this shit real quick too. Sure, my sure. communications is going to be where all your leads start coming in. So click on my communications as, as you start to run ads and they start to click on your ads, this is where you'll see all your leads. But every single lead that comes in is going to come into a list. So, so it's the list where we'll want to be focused on. Right here, you'll just see a, 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 a random list of all your leads. But right there, when you click on list, you'll see all the different lists. There are two different things. Because let's say, for example... I'm running an ad for my soap. Those people are going to be right here in the leads, but they're also going to be on a very specific list. That's going to be the soap list. Okay. And then if I'm running ads for my massage business, then I'll see all the leads right here, but those leads are going to be on a very specific list. So scroll to the top, go back up. You'll see list. Those leads will be on my massage list. Okay. So every single lead that comes in right here, again, you'll see a list of every lead, but we want to narrow it in, click on list. We want to see what list these people are on because you're going to see a list of every lead, but I need to know what list they're on. So it's list. So let's start here. Let's, let's create a list. Let's, let's hit that green square and let's just, let's just create a list. Can we start with soap? Yeah, for sure. And, and let's name this one. It, it's either going to be soap leads or it's going to be soap customers. Mm. Two different things. One's just a lead. They just, maybe they just inquired because they wanted some information, but then one's an actual customer. They bought my shit. Okay. Right. So you can name it whatever, whatever you want. And in this public description uh -huh. This is what they see if they were to ever unsubscribe. Okay. So if you look at your inbox and you look at all them damn junk emails that you probably got, if you open up any of them and you go to the very bottom and you unsubscribe, there should be a description of what you were even subscribed to. Okay. That's that. So what I would do here is I would put something like, I wouldn't just put the name. I would put thank you for thank you for subscribing to and leave that. No, oh, you could have left it. But I would have oh. just put thank you for subscribing to and then and then and then that. So they know what the hell I'm, they're subscribed to. Perfect. Cool. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, cool. So hit next and then you'll hit back to my list to the bottom left, back to my list. And then next. So now, every we we have to create a create a page in order for those people to even land on that list. That be next, but at least we got the list. So that's the list right there. Nice. So so now let's hit the green button again. Let's create a massage one. So these would be, yeah, massage leads or whatever the hell you want to name it, spa leads or whatever. Perfect. And then. Perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. Okay, cool. So those are your spa leads. And then back to list. And then let's create another list under customers 
for the for the for the soap and then clients for the spa because now those will be two different lists two different types of people you know yeah Perfect. And then, and then do one for soap customers. Can I tell you how sexy my soap is? <laughs> I'd love to fill it. It's like, I, I put a lot of work into this man and it's, um, you know, what I ended up paying wholesale for it. I can't type top and type it. So let me do one thing at a time. So do you have it on a website yet at all or not? No, I've been hustling it to my clients. And the cool thing is one of them has psoriasis um, on her and then eczema. Mm -hmm. And it's just tearing it up. <laughs> so wow. I'm really, really excited about it. That outside of all like the spiritual woo-woo stuff I put into it, it just, the bubbles feel good on the, on the body. It doesn't dry you out. It's 100% an essential soap. It's not this bullshit that's been sitting on, you know, it's just quality, quality stuff. Every ingredient has a specific purpose to either heal the body or to clear up some skin issues. It's a body soap, not a face soap, but I'm, I'm very proud of my work. So, so you made it? You make it? Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, wow. I work, I'm working with a chemist, uh, a local chemist that oh my gosh. Um, we were trying to get the scent together, but it smelled too cheap like some bullshit Bath and Body Works or Victoria, you know, some, some bullshit. And oh I'm like, my clients are on that tip. Like everybody's all about herbalist, holistic healing. So I gave him a massage and, um, and I told him, I said, I want you to take this experience and put it into my soap. These are the essential oils that I used. I want it to smell good. I don't want it to smell, I want it to smell unisex. I want it to smell like earth. So the first soap I came out with was, is literally called earth. And um, the second one is black magic. And wow. it's absent, yeah, activated charcoal. That's the one that's clearing people's skin up, which I'm super duper excited about. <laughs> so D, that right there, that's, oh my God. I, I get the chills when I, when a light bulb goes on and I'm like, when I have an epiphany and I'm like, that's it. Yes. That, here, so here's what I'm about to tell you. Uh -huh. That's it. That's the business. That's the freaking, that we, we need to be, fo I mean, you can focus on whatever the hell you want to do with these Facebook ads, but that's the business. Like we should be running Facebook ads on that. Yeah. On the soap. On the soap. Yeah. Like, that's like, important. okay. So then there's another part that I guess I need to express to you. I am working with a particular company or I'm beginning to work with a particular, particular, blah, 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 particular company in Wisconsin, specifically um, for a nonprofit to hire felons to make the soap because I already have the proprietary wow. and under contract and I just have to like get it trademarked and registered and all that stuff. Um, but I really want the soap to be more of a nonprofit gig. Wow. So I want to be able to employ, um, you know, a lot of felons that, you know, I love it. My job is looking to create a business out of it. Right. Oh, so I love it. Kind of where this whole soap thing came from. That's part of it, the business part. The other part is when I was a kid, I told you I'm a, um, my parents were, my mother was a debutante. Mm -hmm. means her mother was. So for Christmas, um, there would be these beautiful, huge boxes from Neiman Marcus, like pink, pink and white stripes, blue and white. And in them were these body soaps. And back then, like early 80s, it was like $20 a bar of soap, which is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. And so I remember like, damn, when I get older, I'm about to, I'm gonna have one of those boxes. And of course, when I got older, they weren't doing that anymore, which is cool. <laughs> but anyway, I got high with my good buddy and I was like, um, we were just talking shit about, you know, my passion for felons, my passion for sex trafficking with Cuba mm -hmm. and um, with the women particularly. And I was talking about my love for like taking showers. He's like, it's kind of weird, you know, but I'm like, you don't understand. I work with the public. I work with other people's bodies. So I have to shower two, three times a day. I'm, I'm weird like that. Um, so anyway, he was like, yeah, well, what are you going to do about it? I'm like, I'm going to create my own fucking soap since my grandmother didn't ever put me on to those Neiman Markets ones. And that's kind of where it all started. And it's literally happened COVID. 
mm-hmm. the whole soap thing, the nonprofit, all of that. So mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah, that's, um, that is I my, that, biggest I want to employ people who nobody gives a fuck about like the marginalized people. Mm-hmm. Um, for instance, like my, on my dad's side, a lot of my cousins have records. I've had some issues in my background and my whole thing is like, listen, um, <laughs> Like for instance, my cousin, he he went to prison for 14 years for selling weed in the state of Damn. fucking California. Damn. He now owns a dispensary. So the thing he's paying taxes on is the one thing that incriminates him that he'll never mm. be scared of. And so he's in the process of getting an expungement because there was some other bullshit attached to it. Mm-hmm. You know, it's going to be a little bit challenging. So um, I'm just, I don't know. It's And the whole Carter Pharmacy thing, if you notice that part, um, comes from my... I want to say my um my my grandfather, my father's side. He was a pharmacist in the early 1900s, which doesn't make sense for Black people back in America mm-hmm. to actually have had a degree um and to work as a pharmacist. So just wanted to. That's kind of where that came from, comes from. So it's all kind of tying together. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. That that's a huge opportunity right there for you. Yeah. Like huge, huge, yeah. huge, huge. I love that, man. Yeah. We'll get into that then. We'll get more into that for sure. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the whole thing is um, with with the chemist that I'm working with, he was like, man, you know, it, it takes me like four days to make your batches of soap. He's like, but I need more hands. And I'm like, there's a lot of people coming out of the prison system who need a gig. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and mm-hmm. I'm not going to hustle them and pay them some bullshit $5 an hour just because they got a rig. I want to pay them well. Mm-hmm. And, um, yeah, that's kind of like my heart. So he's he's game with it. It's just a matter of, vetting them all so um wow yeah, that's- wow <laughs> that that's gonna be huge that's gonna be really really that could be big d that could be really big it, it needs to be it has to be like I'm, i don't know if i'll have have kids i'm 38 i'll be 40 in a few years so this would be my legacy this is very mm-hmm. important to me mm-hmm. the spa is important as well but mm-hmm. i can't be hustling you know two hour massages six times a day mm-hmm. anymore you know what i'm saying so like, yeah yeah, that that that's why the light bulb went on because I already know where you're coming from. I already know your pain point. I already know what you're kind of sick of, and that's working, and that's all that other. So, re- that's why I'm mentioning like running Facebook ads is gonna get you way busier than ever on the massage side, mm-hmm. and I don't know if that's exactly what you wanted, right? So, to make money where you're, what's that? I gotta hire people, man. Oh yeah, yeah, of course. You end up having to go that route, of course. But to make money while you're sleeping, that's yeah. the soap business. Yeah. Can I, um, how are you on time today? I have, I have another, another call in 20 minutes. Well, Damn it. L- a little less, but, <laughs> but, but at the same time, we can always chat after, or we can always ch- chat tomorrow or whatever. Okay. Yeah. 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 Um, but let's go back to the car real quick and let's, what, what did, what did you have? What do you mean? I'm sorry. I well, no, no, it, it's the same thing. I've been trying to show you that stupid, the, the guy, Abu or whatever. Abu Faf now. Yeah. 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 Yeah, so anyway, one of his clients owns Butter Depot, and she started his program, which is similar to what I'm doing with you, mm-hmm. and blew the fuck up. I mean, I'm talking about pallets of shea butter, wet shea butter, going mm. across nationwide. And she started this, um, she made $15,000 in her first month, mm. which is phenomenal. Um, so then there's that. <laughs> Man. So she did the same thing you're doing as far as Facebook ads, but she just went with another dude mm-hmm. and um, killing the game. I mean, I, every time I go on their Insta stories, seeing these pallets being shipped out, and mm-hmm. she charged twenty five dollars a fucking bottle. Could you imagine that shit? Wow, wow. You know what I mean? So like, why the fuck can I do that? You can, you can. Wow. Yeah. It's game time, man. It's game time. So yeah. all this stuff that I'm showing you right now is just is just the foundation. It's like it's what to build on. You know, it's just these, in this case, it's this, it's this basic software that can control and, and create a lot of that. So it all, it all happens here. Like it all happens here. Like this list, this is, this is going to be your goal in the future. Whatever business you're building, it's all about the email list. That's why this Kartra investing it and paying for it monthly. It's all about my list. Like these leads that are, that I'm catching, let's say I'm running Facebook ads and I'm capturing a lead or I'm running an Instagram ad and I'm capturing a lead. The gold is when you can nurture that lead. And that happens through an email autoresponder. So again, Kartra landing pages, email autoresponder, and then my online calendar if I need appointments. But this email autoresponder, this list is gonna be your gold. Because okay. when you're not running Facebook ads, you're sending out an email, you're sending out an email to your list. 
and that yeah. email has a promotion, 10% off for all those who order in the next 10 minutes, our latest freaking scent of body soap. Like yeah. you'll be able to send out these emails in the future once you have this list going and that's, that's, that's free. You're not paying for ads anymore. Love so imagine it. having, you know, 3000 leads on a soap list. And, and now I'm just emailing this list every week, a different promotion. Right. Like that's you know, money. Yeah, you no, know, it is. The soap gal, I don't know if you're familiar. Uh, the, I didn't realize soap was such a big thing, first of all. Mm -hmm. um, anyway, there's this woman called the Soap Gal. She's based out of Phoenix, uh, excuse me, Mesa, Arizona. Mm -hmm. And just last month, she did 65,000 bars. 65,000 bars. Wow. She sells them wholesales for $3 a bar. Mm. Let me do the math. Mm. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? And she started yep. out with me just taking a little class and then blew the fuck up. Not mm -hmm. over, obviously over time, blew up. Yeah. Yep. So, yep. Yep. I'm telling yeah. you, man, it's, 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 it's paid traffic. It's either you're getting the buzz and you, and people know you cause you're doing offline shit. You're running, what are you doing? Freaking running a commercial, running a radio ad. It's like, there's only so many traditional ways of marketing offline. But if you're doing anything online, you're either, you're either building an Instagram page and you got a shitload of followers because you're posting every damn day. You're doing Instagram lives every damn day, all day. That's how people gain momentum on Instagram because they're posting consistently every day, all day. That's, that's one way you're going to do it organically. Instagram for the bars, for the soap, that's, that's, that's where you want to be. But if you're not posting every day, all day, and building that buzz and you're commenting on everyone's post, that's where the engagement comes. So when you start following other pages and you comment and you reply to every one of your comments, that's all micromanaging. That's why building it organically is fucking hard because yeah. it's time consuming. I'm on my phone every freaking day, all day, right? Just because I'm posting and then I'm replying to everyone's comment and then I'm following other pages and, and, and commenting on their posts so they can see my page and hopefully follow me back. That's a lot of time. So, so what I'm saying though, is you're either, you're either going to do that and blow up Instagram organically, or you're going to go get straight to it and run ads. So a person like your friend pushing 65,000 units, you either have a crazy buzz on social media because you're posting all damn day or you're running ads. Bottom line. It, it, it's, either, it's either, or it's either, or you're not doing anything offline because anything offline is too damn expensive. So you're doing something right. online. You're doing something on specifically on social media. So when you're doing something specifically on social media, again, you're either going to do it organically and you're micro micro managing it all, or you're going to get straight to it and run an ad. She had to be pushing that many units. She's running ads. And so Instagram could be your best place for Instagram ads, right. which, which we're going to learn. So I'm going to teach you how to run those Instagram ads. But, but that's where you want to be is, is, is Instagram ads, taking them to a checkout page, very simple where they place the order and buy your shit. Like very, very simple. But, yeah. but, but again, I, yeah, that's, you got two different types of marketers, someone that's posting all day organically or someone that's getting straight to it and running ads. And, hmm. and, and those are, those are your two options. And that's why with me, I just get straight to it and run ads. That's why if you go to any of my pages, I don't have it popping on anything because I'm not posting organically like that. Like I don't have the time, like I don't want to put in the time to, to post all damn day and then reply to everyone's comments and, and try to build a buzz that way. I just want to get straight to it and target my audience and get them to buy my shit. Like let's just get straight to the point. You know, that's, yeah. that's paid ads for you. So that's where we're at right now is we got to set this up. This is our email. So this is where, what we're going to focus on our list. We're going to start building up a list of people who are either buying our shit or interested in buying our shit. That's the difference between these leads and clients. Okay. So, so that's the list. Now let's create a page real quick. Let's just click on my pages because in order for them to be on a list, again, they have to go to a page. So if they see my Instagram post or if they see my Instagram ad, they're clicking on it to go to a page or with Instagram. That's another thing. Yeah. Go ahead and click on that one with Instagram. You're not even putting a link on any of the posts. The link is in the bio. So, so that link is, that so whenever you're seeing any business and they're posting something and then you go to their page and there's a link in the bio that's where the money's at so right. so your link in the bio is this page right here so that's that's how important this one page is that's how important Kartra is this one page can make you a lot of money this one page 
And so it all starts with a squeeze page. It all starts with a simple landing page. I'm getting someone to click on the link in my bio and I'm taking them to the one page where they where they can either enter their name and email to, to download my coupon for their massage or they're clicking on the link in the bio and they're going to the one page to buy my soap. That's it. Yeah. Like that's all there is to it. So now we have the tool for that one link. And so it all starts here. It all starts with, um, I mean, you can, there's many different templates and that's all this is. These are all templates. So you got squeeze pages, click on all of them, squeeze pages. You got video sales pages. You got thank you pages. So the squeeze pages, this is for like, let's say in the massage, for the massage business, we're giving out some type of dis discount. We're having them download some type of coupon. This is the type of page for that. Okay. Interesting. So they click and they end up coming to a page like this. What's that? This kind of look like yours. Well, that's, yeah, that's one of my pages, but, but, um, the landing page, it would be an image of something. Uh -huh. or, or maybe an image of you and then, and then, and then a headline, you know, click, enter your name and email to download your 25% off your next massage or whatever like that, you know, like a simple page, it's one page. But what makes this so cool is that the template, it's already there. Like you can change the colors, you can change the image, you can change the text, but the template is already there. All yeah. you do is work around it, you know? Okay. So, so let's, um, so in this case, let's just kind of think of the massage, the, the massage business. Okay. So let's just choose any random template for now for the squeeze pages. Oh. Yeah, in, in, the, in here, let's just choose one of these pages. Do you mind repeating that you're breaking up a little bit? Yeah, so right here, we'll just focus on the massage business for this example. And, and okay. let's just choose one of these squeeze pages. Is this a for real one or we're just choosing it for the hell of it? Both, I mean, we can, we can either, choose a for real one or do one for the example, but whatever it is, you can always change it. You can always delete it. You can always edit it. You can change it all. So nothing's, nothing's, nothing's permanent. Yeah, that's a good one. So now, now you selected it. So go ahead and go all the way to the top, go all the way to the top and launch builder. Perfect. So now we're going to give it a page name and um, it is what it is. So freaking massage opt-in page or whatever, like, um, I really yeah. want to call it muscle therapy, but yeah, well, th you could do that too. That this is just internal, so only you're gonna see this. You're this is just for you to name the page, and then let's put it in a category. So get out of there and then click on manage my categories. All the pages that pertain to this one project is going to be in a specific category. So go ahead and maybe name it the same, the category, name it the same. Perfect, so click on add. Now any page that pertains to this will go in that category. So click on done, and then you're gonna hit the drop down. I'm sorry, click on what, you're breaking done. up a bit? Click on done, done. yeah. Okay. And then hit the category drop down and put it in that category, perfect. And then the site, no site in particular. Click on that one and then click create. Okay, so this is how we set up a new page and it's all the same. So this is our first page. We, we name it, we put it in a category, no site um, in particular, and then we come into the actual builder. This is where all the magic happens. And so as you come into here, in the very beginning, there's always this tutorial, but you can just click on the button, click start tutorial and just just keep hitting next, 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 next. All this is doing is explaining what everything is to the left, which I'll, I'll, I'll give you a crash course on. So just next, 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 go through that all the way to the very end. Okay, so now we're in the actual builder. So everything, that whole tutorial that you just went through was just explaining what everything is to the left and okay. what everything is at the top. Okay. But 99% of the time, all you're going to ever be clicking on to the left is sections and components. That's where everything is at sections okay. and components. So nice. you can click on sections and you can click on all these. What I would do is I would play around with all this. I would click on all this shit, just go through all of it and see mm -hmm. all these different things that are, that are in here. And all it is is drag and drop. Oh, cool. 
and then you just hover over the word and then you can you can hit the T and that will allow you to change the text. Fun. Yeah, so and then and then you can highlight it and change the color. You can change the freaking okay. the, the the font. Like you could change the size. But but one thing you want to do though is you want to try to stay with the template. You can change the color, you can change the image, you can change the background, how it's that beige and there's those lines. You can change because all that is is an image, those lines in the back of that beige. Uh -huh. Like you see that design, those yeah, those yeah, those little whatever they're called. Like you could change all that, but I wouldn't worry about having to add more shit on top of it because the template, the way it's designed, it's already designed to convert. Like it's already designed for the way it should be. All you want to do is change the aesthetics of it, if anything. Okay. Okay. Don't think think you need to build a whole new page. Like you don't. Just if anything, just yeah, components, sections. That's where you'll be. So if you want to add an image, click, drag it over, and you can put a new image in that in that placeholder. Nice. See, so, but at the same time, let's X out of that. Yeah, hit that X. At the same time, this whole bottom, this whole top section is not necessary because again, we're we're adding more to the template, which we don't wow. need to do. Like the template was fine the way it was. You know what I mean? Like, right. so hit that red, hit that red to the right, and delete that. So hit that red that red square to the right. Oh my bad, this guy. Yeah, hit X and delete. And now delete that whole entire section. So now it's just this back this this we're back to what it was to begin with, which is this right here. So you can change out that image. You could change the background how that gray is is like that. You can change that. So click on that red box to the right, and that. You'll, yeah, hit the pencil, and that will take you to the background. So hit background, hit image selected, the blue one, image selected, and that's that background image. So type in, like to the very right, you can always upload your own image or you can type in something. So type in anything random. Type in freaking massage, yeah, and see if there's anything. Okay, perfect. So you can always choose, watch, choose any random image. Well, definitely this one's with their black hands. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nice. So click on it. Uh-huh. Click on it, select, and then confirm the green one. Oh. And then the and then to the left, the green apply. Click on that. See, and so that gave you that background. Now the image opacity, that 20%, that's what controls the the um the um the freaking the op I guess the opacity of it so you can take it up and and make it make it stand out even more or you can you can blend it in you know so that's why you want to play around with with it all right. and just see whatever you know whatever you like but and then you can even take out that image you could take out that chick if you want and just have that background image yeah like um you know what I mean like that's 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 as basic as it gets and that's that and then and then whenever you see a a, a box like that you can always drag over component or you can delete that. And, and the way to delete it is go to the very, very top. You'll see columns. At the very top, click on columns. You're those, there's two modes that you're in. You got the columns mode and then you got the components mode. Click on columns. That allows you to just hover over stuff and see exactly where, what is what. Like you can start deleting different things. So, so in this case, that image... Watch, scroll up real quick. That image, scroll to the right, to the right side, cur move your cursor to right there. So that image was in the pink. So that pink, you can delete that, hit that X on the pink, and that would delete that section where that image went. Okay. Where the lady was. Where the lady was, that chick, that white chick. Okay. okay. But it ends, up bringing, it ends up bringing the format like this. So I don't really like it like this. So hit undo. See if we can undo it and go back. Undo at the very top, undo. Okay. So if you don't want it to be like that to the, see there's, there's this image right here which allows that column to be to the left. That's how I would keep it. I would put an image of you right there if anything. Yeah. Like an image of you goes right there and then we keep this form to the left 
the the yeah keep that right there okay. and, and you're good so right now you're in columns mode if you go to components mode which is where you'll be most of the time components mode allow you to kind of see and edit each individual component so whether it's the bullet points whether it's the image whether it's the title so hover over the title to the left the title the subject line the title right there so you so that's what component mode allows you to do is to is to dig in and and hover over each individual component of the page okay. whereas the column allows you to kind of hover over the entire section and you can delete that entire section if you wanted to okay. so right here you can just hit you can hit the t and then you can you can um you can you can change the title of that love it okay yeah so put something there yeah there you go and then and then you can always get back to it okay perfect and then the headlines bullet points and then that form is where they'd put their name and email to download and right there where it says that button submit now mm -hmm. that button we can change it we can write whatever but i would put something like click click here to 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 download your free coupon or whatever the hell you want to you want you want to say but that's the call to action button once that, once that name and email is entered and they click that submit now, that lead goes onto your list. Okay. So the video that you had me make, where would that have gone on this page? Which video? Was it for the ad? The thank you one and like download now. You, you told me to make a video like thanking people, enter their email. Yes. So, so that would be for the thank you page. So let's, let's get out of this one. So now that we have this one up, it, actually, there's one more thing I want you to do to this. Yeah. Whenever I come into a, a page, I always click on settings to the left. The very first thing that I do, settings to the very left, SEO parameters, and that muscle therapy, you mm -hmm. named the page that. And by default, it's also the name of the title. That title what is what shows publicly. So right at the top, you have all those tabs open. Those tabs are titled Kartra Weekly Q&A, Kartra, Facebook with the one in the parentheses. You got all those titles in the tab. That's also your title of the tab. So when you go and pull up this page in, another, in a new tab and people go to this page, they're going to see that in the title. So whatever you want, if you want it to be named Muscle Therapy, then cool, leave it. But sometimes you'll want to change it. Sometimes you'll want to name the page something different. You can, you're, you're naming it internally as you're setting it up, which is what we did. We put it in the category, right? You named it there, but sometimes in the tab, you may want to name it something different. And so that's where I changed the title of the tab right there. Okay. Now, one other thing, scroll down. This image, image selected, no image selected, click on that. Yeah, you'll always click the apply. Whenever you do anything inside of there, click apply for sure. But hit that blue button, no image selected. This is the image, click that one. Let's choose that one. Let's just use that one for the hell of it. And then confirm and then apply, the green one, apply. That image is what's shown. So if anybody goes and shares this link on social media, that image shows as well. I presume they're copyrighted and they're all good to Oh, go. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. All the images are stock images. You, you can use them for sure. Um, but whenever you share a link on social media, whenever you share a link on Facebook, whenever you share a link on, Inst on, on, on LinkedIn, whenever you share a link on Twitter, you share a link. It could be for anything. You share a link for anything. There's an image that, that pulls with it. There's an image that will show. That's mm -hmm. the image in this case. So if you ever share this link on Facebook, that image will show nice okay. okay so so you can always update that later but here is the landing page so go ahead and so so let's exit this page and there's a three-step exit so hit the green button in the top right actions we're going to save progress that's step one and then we close out this and then we're going to hit it again actions and we're going to publish live and then here's the link so get the page link this right here is where you'll eventually you'll add your own domain where it's it's your own dot com but right now we can just use the Kartra one but what i always do is i always at least customize the back end of it so hit that pencil and let's get rid of that dgb one hit the pencil to the right to the right to the right the pencil the edit there you go 
get rid of that one. Let's name it something, something different. Name it muscle therapy. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So that's that page. So now copy that link and simply open it up in a new tab. So whenever you, whenever you, you know, do anything to your pages, you can always, you know, test it and check it by opening it up. Cool. Look at me. Yes. <laughs> yes, for sure. Yeah, so, so that's the landing page. And then we got to create a form that goes in it, um, which, which will be that placeholder. Mm -hmm. And then that form, once they enter the name and email, then they click the yellow button, then they go to the thank you page. Okay. Yeah, X out of that, X out of that one. And let's go back to the cart to the cart one. And that video would go on the thank you page. So let's hit Kartra, that tab at the top. Let's go back to Kartra, that one. Yeah. So now let's let's close this. And then we hit the green one one more time, the third time, and we return to dashboard. And then hit the red one, edit. So it's a three-step exit, okay, on all pages. That's how you would exit. Um now what we'll do is create the thank you page real quick. So hit that green one. And then let's go to thank you pages and let's look at different templates that are here for the thank you page. And so that's why this, this call was so important for Kartra because without these two pages, there's no more Facebook ads. Like we have to be able to put that pixel, which we'll do on our next call that pixel goes on these pages. Custom audiences, when we run Facebook ads, are from these pages. A custom conversion, which I'm gonna show you how to set up on our next call through Facebook Ads Manager, that's on this page, the thank you page specifically. So this was a very important step right here to get this all set up. Absolutely. Okay, so, so let's choose any random template for the thank you page. We can always change it later. So this will, be, this will be muscle therapy, thank you. Muscle therapy, thank you. And, and, and as you're building out these pages, always keep it consistent with the name. One's okay. going to be the landing page, which is the, the opt-in page, the squeeze page. And then one's going to be the thank you page. And then we're going to put it all in that same category, just like that, perfect. And then hit, hit create. And then, and then the first thing we'll do when you, when you come in is click on, click on settings. And that's, and that's what I'm referring to when it comes to sometimes you'll want to change the title of the page. So hit, yeah, hit start tutorial, go all the very end, right? Internally, we named it muscle therapy. Thank you. And, yeah. and by default, that's also going to be the name in the tab. Well, okay. I don't want it. I don't, I don't want that to be named that in the tab. Like I don't want people to see it publicly at the top. And it says muscle therapy. Thank you. Like I'd rather just put thank you for, or I, I'd rather like, so let's hit settings to the left. Where am I going? Settings oh. right there. Settings. So SEO parameters. This is the first thing you do every time on a new page, make sure you want that same title. So if anything, I may just take out muscle therapy and just put thank you for downloading your coupon or thank you for whatever. Thank you for, or, or I'd put, I'd put, I'd put schedule your appointment. Now let's put that schedule your appointment. Now delete all of it, delete all of it, schedule your appointment. Now that's what I'm saying. So internally you named it muscle therapy. Thank you. But I don't want that shown publicly. I want schedule your appointment now. Right. So I want that. And, and with the thank you page, you don't need to put an image because again, the image is only when people share the page for social media. No one's sharing this page. Gotcha. Right. So, okay. so watch. So now hit the green, let's, let, let's hit the green actions at the top, top, right. Hit save page or, or yeah, save progress and then go publish live. And, and let me show you what I'm saying. So publish live. You're breaking. Uh, yeah. Publish live actions, 
publish live and then and then change out the link get the page link let's rename it take out that etd2 and just put and, and i would i would put schedule your appointment now schedule appointment now yeah schedule appointment now or whatever you named whatever you named in the title what did you put did you put schedule your appointment now or did you put schedule of, i want it to stay the same you like, want to, okay yeah all this has to be schedule consistent your appointment now. schedule your appointment okay. now Awesome. So you'll see what I mean by, by all this shit once, we, once I show it to you right now. So schedule your appointment now. Hit the green one, copy that, open it up in a new tab. So as people land here, they just opted in, they just gave up their name and email, they're coming here. See how up in the tab, schedule your appointment. And then I see it in the link, schedule your appointment. Right? I'd rather say that than muscle therapy, thank you. I see what you're saying. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So this right here, you happen to grab a thank you page that doesn't have a video, but we can always add a video spot. So let's do that. So go back to the go back to the cartridge, the builder, and let's just add a video spot. So close this out and then let's click on sections to the left. I think it's, it might be sections or components. Again, those are the only two you'll be working out of, sections and components. Everything we need is in those two sections, sections or components. So we're looking for video, and it might be in components. Video, 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 videos. Perfect. So click on that, and then there's different styles, or there's different type of templates or whatever. They, they look a little different. Like that one has a little shading on the bottom, like little, little shit like that. So grab whatever one, like one has a little shadow at the bottom, but you can grab whatever, grab. And then in the, what you want right there, right where it turns green, right where it turns green, that's where you drop it. So that's how it is with components. When you're in the components, you'll drag it and, 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 and you'll see an orange and a green line. You're going to drop it where it's green. Okay. Okay. So right here, this is where that video would go. So they see your Facebook ad, you're promoting a, a coupon on a massage. They click on it, they go to your landing page, they enter their name and email, they click submit, they then come to this thank you page. On this thank you page, it's a video of you. Hey guys, thank you so much, this is D Carter. Thank you for downloading your free 25% off coupon for your next massage. I'm super fired up that you got this far with me. I wanted to personally introduce myself and let you know a little bit about my background and why I'm so excited and passionate about what we do here at 1-1 or 11, 11 wax spawn and, or freak, yeah. whatever the heck. <laughs> <laughs> you say that shit in the damn video, right? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. so, so here's the bullet points. I'm thanking you. There's four bullet points. I'm thanking you. Number one, number two, I'm introducing myself. Right. Number three, I'm telling you to check your email because I just sent you over your coupon. And then number four, I'm telling you to click the button below. Let's add a button. So let's add a button. So, Oh, Wait, how do I add the video that I already made? Oh, where did you go though? Did you, oh, you where? got, where, where did that, I think we got out of it. Um, and that's another thing. If you get out of it, nothing saves. So hit the, hit the, where did that window go? Did you, um, is it at the bottom, is it at the bottom right? Where that trash can's at? Or any of those? I'm sorry, trash can. Oh, you're talking about. Are any of those it or no? No, that's those aren't it. It just kind of. Okay, so go back to it. So hit the three dots. No, yeah. no, we got to go back to the page. These three hit, dots. No, 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 on the page. Muscle therapy. Thank you. Click on those three dots. The thank you page. No, yeah. not that one. The thank you page. Oh my God, I'm sorry. No, it's all good. Yeah, I, I think you accidentally exited it. So click on edit. We got to add back that video, that video slot. But, but what I was saying is that, that that video, four bullet points, thanking them, introducing yourself, That's telling great. them to check their email, and then number four, telling them to click the button to schedule your appointment now. Okay. Yeah, and so I have that. I just need to upload it, I guess. Yes. But yeah. It's okay. Not, it's a janky one. It's not. No, it's all good. It's all good. We're we're doing all this just for practice, and you'll you'll tighten it up. No worries. 
Well, I know you have to go. Um, I don't want to hold you. Yeah. No, we'll, we'll let's let's knock out this last part real quick. I just I just postponed it. I, I already messaged them, so okay. I just pushed it back a little bit. So let's get started. So now, so that's why if you that's why it's so important as you're in here doing all this shit, hit the green button in the top right actions and save progress. Like do that every few minutes because. Okay. You don't want to build out the whole damn thing and then you exit like you just did and you lost everything. Right now. You, you know what I mean? So so drag over that video might be Yeah, there we go. And so that background, that pink, you can change all that stuff. So again, you don't want it no 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 not height. Put it low. Yeah, right there, right there. So we have the logo, you got the headline, you got the sub headline, and then you got the video. Okay. Now what we also want to do is hit the back, hit the block templates, hit that back. Let's get out of there. X out of this, go back to, it might be sections. We're looking for buttons. So it's either in the, in the sections or the components. I still don't know it by heart. It's either one. So it might be components. Yeah. We're looking for buttons. Okay, right there, perfect. Okay, so now just choose which button you like. We can change the color, change the text on it, all that shit. Just but scroll through, you see all the different styles of buttons. There's a bunch of them. Yeah. So scroll down below the video and, and drop it where that line turns. Maybe a little lower, go lower. See if you can go lower with it. Lower, 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 lower. Okay, so those are not, that's not where it goes. Okay, that's fine. Put it up. We'll put it right there. Perfect. Okay, so now... X out of this, block templates, X out of that, go to the button, hover over the button, and then let's edit the button. So what we want to do here is we can change the color, we can change the text on it, we can, but what I really want to do real quick right now is scroll to the bottom of this part, scroll to the bottom, 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 center it. So the alignment, center, and then apply. Okay, so that'll bring it to the middle. Now what I want to do is I want to make that button a little bigger. So scroll, scroll up on the page. Yeah, right there. So go to the button. Okay, so let's let's make that button a little bigger. So button size, why don't you go giant to the left? Left, giant. Go giant. You don't really need it full, but go giant and go to the very bottom. Click the green button, apply. Okay, so it's a little bigger. You can go, you can play around with it. You can go squared. You can go, um, if full, full kind of is too, too big, but try it anyways. Let's see if it goes from left to right. Yeah, see how it goes left to right? It's kind of too damn big. But um, I'll just leave it at giant, and that's fine. Um, because what you're gonna do is you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna yeah. Actually, we're gonna write the text. So let's go to the top, go to text. As you write out the text, that's what's gonna make it actually expand, and that's fine. So click here to schedule your massage now, or something like that. Wow. You know, click here to schedule your next appointment, or click here to schedule your time now, or whatever the hell. Yeah, so as you write this out, then it expands that button, and that's perfect. Okay. Click apply. Okay, see how it opened up? And then that icon, that arrow, you can always change that as well. That's the icon. So there's a bunch of different icons in there. You, you got the angle right, so you can go to – there's so many different ones, like all these different – like all these different angles, like, I mean, okay. icons. There's so many different I didn't ones. I even know these details. This, oh, my God, this is a lot. <laughs> That's hilarious. I didn't know people cared yeah. about it. Does it matter? No, it doesn't at all. Just It's all preference. All this shit is preference. The color, the icons, all that shit is preference. But just keep in mind, this is all a one-time thing. Like, once you knock this shit out, you never have to do this stuff again. Like, this is just the time-consuming part. Okay. But this is what it's going to take to build something, you know, to capture a damn lead and freaking start making money from from, from these leads, you know? Yeah, so, absolutely. And so that link, that button will be linked to your calendar which we'll set up on our next call. Um, okay. But then there's a video. I'm going to show you where there's a video for the calendar. You can, you can go over that and, and, and it walks you through how to set it up. And there's right. videos on all this shit, but whenever we get time together, then, then I can help you with all this stuff. But that button will be linked and click on the button again, go back down, click on edit, click on the pencil. On this guy? Yeah, the pencil. And let me show you where the color is at. So if you just scroll down on the left, there's that color. So the background color, that blue. Anytime you see that little circle to the left, that's the color. So to the left, that's the color right there. So you can just click on that. No, to the left, to the left. 
right there, that blue. So click on that, and that's where you can change around and play with the different colors. So cool. whatever your so color may be. what my, my mood board is, then. All those numbers for the colors mm -hmm. for my mood board or my brand board or whatever. Perfect. So then just find your exact color, and then let's just rock with that color. Okay. Which one is it? Is it... Oh, I, well, it's, it's in another room. I don't want to. No, no, no. Can you can you kind of somewhat eyeball it right here? Is it is it that color right there? No, no. Um, no, I I need the numbers. Okay, no, it's all good. But yeah, that's where you would paste in the numbers right there, and then just click apply. Okay. And that and that would be it right there. But click apply for now. Yeah, you can just see how it changes, and so you can grab the code and just paste it in, and and you can you can have that number or that exact color. Okay, cool. Okay, so so that's where your calendar link would go. They click on that and boom, it takes you straight to your Kartra calendar. And that's it. Like that's it. Like, but this is where that video would go. So for example, hover over the video slot and click on edit. Click on the pencil. And then so that video you can host it on Kartra. You can, you can, which is what I recommend, or, or you can host it on YouTube or Wistia or Vimeo, but it's really just Kartra or YouTube. So if you want to just host it on Kartra, that's perfect. That's what you should do. And you just click on that. You um, click, if it's in a category, then you would click the category and then you would find the video and, and then you would just upload it. So super, super simple, but I'm going to show you how to upload the video first. So X out of this, but this is where you'll find it. You'll come back in here. You'll hit the drop down and you'll find that video after we upload it. So this is so scroll to the very bottom of the page what else is down below so you got you got all this you can edit that hover over it edit you can match your icons your your social media icons and this is just one template you know there's so many different templates yeah. that you can that you can use but i, I don't want to get caught up too much on yeah exactly this is perfect right here like you know promoing it i guess yeah this this is more than enough like if you just you know freaking edit like number two open our email find the email we just sent you it has the subject line, your next massage, right? So little shit like that, you'd be oh. able to update and that's it. Like, so, but the color, the, all that, you can change all that stuff. So let's get back to this. As long as we have the page up, we're good. So our Facebook pixel, let me show you, hit settings to the left. Let me show you where the pixel is going to go. That's why for the next call, it's, it's to go back into the ads manager. It's to go back into Facebook because this is what we needed. Click on tracking code. At the very, very bottom, this is where your Facebook pixel code goes, the very oh, bottom. Okay. Okay, so we'll get to that on our, on our next call, but that's where, this is what we needed in order to, to even proceed. So now let's hit the green button at the very top, actions, save progress, publish live, return a dashboard. So when do you think we could chat again? I am hoping they pull up my calendar here. Hmm. Are you cooking for Thanksgiving? Yes. Actually, yes and no. Yes and no. Okay. Um, yes. Yes and no. Um, I'll be at my mom's house and we'll, she lives like 10 minutes away from me, but um, she'll be cooking a little bit and then, and then, yeah, we'll bring over some food too. Okay. Yeah. What do you got going on? Well, uh, a little bit of travel cooking for sure. And um, I was thinking about Wednesday, but that will just be too much. It's up to um, you, whatever. Well, I want to keep it consistent, but um, let's go for next Monday if we could. Yeah, for and sure. For sure. Like the last appointment, just so that like whoever had to, I'd rather be the one pushing because I don't really have much going on. You know what I mean? Yeah, for sure. Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. So let's close out of this. Actually, did we already customize the link? Yeah, we did customize the link, right? We did. Yeah, so hit close and then just return a dashboard. Yeah, actions and return a dashboard. Perfect. Okay, so we'll we'll stop there. We got the thank you page. We got the, the squeeze page. Now we just got to work on editing and making it to your liking. Um, and then we'll set up the calendar and then my video. So go ahead and click on my videos to the left. Let's just upload that video real quick. And then we got to set up my forms and then that's it. So let's do the video real quick. So hit that green one and then just upload it right here. Okay. Upload. I'm going to grab my, um, my USB cord so I can get it from my phone. Cause I made it on Perfect. Perfect.
Perfect. Okay, so now we're going to upload it right here. And depending on how long it is or how big the file is, it may take a few minutes, but sometimes it, it happens right away. How do I look up my uh, this camera uploads? No. So I have my phone plugged into my laptop, and I'm going to make You should be able to grab it from here. the last and hopefully it wasn't the one I was I wasn't touching. <laughs> okay, cool. So how do you do you got do you gotta click anything on the bottom right of this window? Is there like an open or a add or anything like that to the very bottom right? No, go to the very bottom bring that window back up to the very, very bottom right. Like how do you Hold on. Yeah, drag that back up real quick. Is there anything to the okay? So how do you how do you do you hit that plus sign? Like how do you add it? What import? Is I don't know if it's import. What do you mean import? Hmm. So if anything, can you drag that to your desktop? Like take it off of out of that file. Go back to the um because I'm not familiar with Mac at all. Like but if anything, take it from the file, like go back to your folder and drag it out of that folder to your, to your, to your desktop. I'm sorry. I don't know what you mean. Like you plugged in your phone. So then you got to see it. Right. So it's under photos. Okay. So, okay. So take it out of the photo fo photos and put it on, drag it to the desktop. Okay, here we go. So that's what that's what that's what scares me about Apple and me wanting because I want a Mac so bad and I want an iPhone so bad, but right. it's just it's confusing as shit to me. Right, right. No, I get it. Like I don't know. Is that just me or is it just completely different than a PC? No, I. Oh my god, this is some shit I have not seen in years. Okay. Um, what the heck? Because that, 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 that video is on your phone. So what you got to do is just take that video, put it on your computer, and then, you, and, then, and then you upload it from there. But I know, I would think you can still, if it's on your phone, it's connected to your computer right now, like I would still think you can grab it. Yeah, totally. I don't know. I hate so go back to Kartra. Oh, okay. Go back to Kartra real quick. So you hit upload video right there, and then you grab the file which is in this, yeah, see, so where's that video at in here? You see, I, I just need to move it to desktop or whatever, but we do that through file, export one video. Can I work and play with it? Maybe I have to email yeah. myself and download it. That will, yeah, you could do that too, for sure. Okay. And then you just upload it there in the videos, and that's it. And then now it's on Kartra, and so now you can go back to that thank you page and add the video to the page. Okay. Why are we doing that? Okay. Oh, my gosh. Is this technically the job of, like, an IT person? No, not at all. I mean – it's just the yeah. fact that we got to get that video off your phone and onto your computer or just, you upload it from here. But I just, I just can't hit upload. I just don't know where that file's at. So 
right here, you should be able to just grab that video from right here. I just don't know where that video is at. I just, I need to save it and I don't know how to save it. That's what I'm saying. Okay, gotcha. So I have to play with this for a little bit. Cause like even all these other uploads, like whatever, you know, whatever, like they don't even have names to it. You know what I'm saying? Like that's yeah. how, and this is from 2013. You see what I mean? So like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I, I haven't, I don't know stuff like this, so, but I can mm -hmm. figure it out. Yeah, we got to figure out how to get that video off your phone onto your computer. Yeah, that's doable. I'll, I'll work on that. Okay. And then you just come back in here to the my videos and just upload it right here and that's it. Okay. And, and then now it's on Kartra and now you can add it to a page. It has to be on Kartra first, which is right here. And then you can go to my pages and add it to the page. Okay. So yeah, let's, let's chat. I'm going to, or do you have my calendar link? I do. It's in my okay. DM. So. Awesome. So just go back to that and then just schedule that call and then we'll, we'll pick up from there. Okay. I All appreciate right, you. Yes, you're so, so welcome. Hit me up if you need anything else, okay? So I'm excited for you. Let's, let's crush the shit out of this. Okay, yeah, you got it, man. Thank All you right, so D. much. Have a happy Thanksgiving. Thanks. Happy Thanksgiving, love. Thank bye -bye. you. Bye-bye.